Tech Beneath the Tracks of India's First Bullet Train High-Speed Rail Corridor Project The Mumbai Ahmedabad High-Speed Rail MAHSR, Corridor, India's first bullet train project, is a significant infrastructural initiative aimed at transforming the country's transportation landscape. Spearheaded by the National High-Speed Rail Corporation Limited, NHSRCL, this ambitious project marks a paradigm shift in India's rail infrastructure development. One of the key areas of innovation within this project lies in the track installation methods employed by NHSRCL. Traditionally, track installation for railway projects has been time-consuming and labor-intensive. However, as per recent news reports, NHSRCL has introduced cutting-edge track installation techniques, leveraging innovation, cutting-edge advanced technology and mechanized processes, to expedite the development of the bullet train corridor. With cutting-edge machinery, the entire process of track installation has been designed and manufactured as per Japanese specifications. Taking the initiative under the Make in India MII, policy, some of the machines are now being manufactured in India. This video provides an in-depth analysis of the project, focusing on the technology and technical innovations used for track installation, the process of mechanized track installation, the various cutting-edge machinery based on Japanese technology employed for these tasks and involved in this high-speed rail construction project, their key features, functionality, their advantages and disadvantages. Explanation of the various processes used, the project progress and future prospects. Details for this video has been gathered from various news reports of May 7, 2024, May 6, 2024 and May 4, 2024. Hi friend. Welcome back to SciTech Buzz One channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. We have observed that 97% of our returning viewers, more than 18,000 in number and first-time viewers totaling more than 75,000 in number, haven't subscribed to our channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would help us reach our first self-set target of 10,000 subscribers and encourage us to do more. Watch this interesting video until the end so that you will not miss out on all the details. Innovative Track Installation Methods Traditionally, track installation for railway projects has been a time-consuming and labor-intensive process. NHSRCL's approach to track installation is founded on innovation and efficiency. The corporation has introduced several advanced methods to streamline the track laying process, ensuring precision, durability, and reduced construction time. Precast Concrete Track Slabs a significant innovation introduced by NHSRCL is the use of precast concrete track slabs. These slabs are manufactured off-site under controlled conditions, ensuring consistent quality and dimensional accuracy. Fabricated to exact specifications, these precast slabs offer several advantages over traditional track laying methods. Once fabricated, the slabs are transported to the project site and installed using mechanized equipment, significantly reducing construction time and labor requirements. Advantages of Precast Concrete Track Slabs Consistent quality, manufactured under controlled conditions, precast concrete track slabs guarantee consistent quality and dimensional accuracy. Reduced construction time, by fabricating these slabs off-site, NHSRCL significantly reduces on-site construction time and labor requirements. Enhanced durability, precast concrete track slabs are engineered for durability, ensuring a longer service life and reduced maintenance requirements. Advanced track alignment and leveling technologies. Ensuring optimal track geometry and alignment is crucial for the safety and operational efficiency of high-speed rail networks. By leveraging cutting-edge surveying and monitoring techniques, the corporation can achieve precise track alignment and minimize deviations. NHSRCL has invested in advanced track alignment and leveling technologies to ensure optimal track geometry and achieve precise track alignment and minimize deviations along the bullet train corridor. Technologies Employed Cutting-edge surveying techniques, NHSRCL utilizes cutting-edge surveying techniques to accurately assess track alignment and geometry, ensuring compliance with international standards. Advanced monitoring systems, 
the corporation employs advanced monitoring systems to track and analyze track alignment in real time, allowing for immediate corrective measures if deviations are detected. Mechanized Track Installation Process The track installation process for the MAHSR corridor is entirely mechanized, employing cutting-edge machinery designed and manufactured as per Japanese specifications. Flash But Welding Machine, FBWM Flash But Welding is a resistance welding process used to join metal workpieces together. The Flash But Welding Machine, FBWM, is a critical component of the track installation process, responsible for welding rails into panels near the track construction base over the viaduct. FBWM is used to weld 25-meter-long, 60-kilograms rails into 200-meter-long panels near the track construction base over the viaduct. A total of three FBWM have been procured, meeting stringent approval methodology standards to ensure high-speed train operation at 320 km per hour. Key Features of FBWM Welding Capacity FBWM welds 25-meter-long, 60kg rails into 200-meter-long panels, ensuring seamless track continuity. High-speed operation, designed to meet the requirements of high-speed train operation at 320 km per hour, FBWM undergoes stringent approval methodology to guarantee safety and reliability. Training and Quality Assurance JRTS conducts comprehensive training for rail weld finishing and rail weld testing, ensuring adherence to quality standards. Advantages of FBWM Dissimilar metals, it can join dissimilar metals with different melting temperatures. High strength, it offers strength factors of up to 100%. No special surface preparation, generally, no special preparation of the weld surface is required. Suitable for highly alloyed steels, it can weld highly alloyed steels that may not be satisfactorily welded by other processes. Even heating, heating is even and extremely local, minimizing cooling stresses and avoiding hardening and cracking in highly alloyed steels. Cost effective, the cost per weld is relatively low. Speed, flash welding is faster than many other methods. Disadvantages of FBWM Flashing operation, the flashing operation produces particles that can damage the welding machine and surrounding areas. Particle safety, it is challenging to protect against these particles during flashing. Track slab laying car, SLC. SLC plays a crucial role in the efficient laying of precast concrete track slabs along the bullet train corridor. Precast track slabs are lifted onto the viaduct, loaded onto specially designed SLCs, and transported to the track laying location. Each SLC can carry up to five slabs, streamlining the installation process. NHSRCL has arranged three SLCs for slab laying work. 1. Installation of track slabs. The SLC is specifically designed for the installation of track slabs on the viaducts along the high-speed rail route. It streamlines the process of laying track slabs, making it more efficient and precise. 2. Functionality Precast track slabs, these track slabs are precast concrete elements that form the track bed. Lifting and transport, SLC facilitates the transportation of precast track slabs from the viaduct to the track laying location, ensuring efficient and precise installation. The SLC lifts these precast slabs onto the viaduct. Capacity, the SLC is capable of transporting five slabs at a time, streamlining the installation process and maximizing efficiency. Placement, once positioned over the track bed, the SLC lays the slabs in their designated positions. Precision laying, SLC ensures precise positioning of track slabs on the RC track bed, guaranteeing optimal track geometry and alignment. Reinforced concrete, RC, track bed, the track slabs are placed on the reinforced concrete track bed, ensuring stability and alignment. 3. Advantages Efficiency The mechanized process using the SLC speeds up the track installation. Precision The SLC ensures accurate placement of track slabs. Labor reduction It reduces manual labor required for slab placement. Rail feeder car, RFC 
RFC is integral to the initial laying of temporary tracks on the RC track bed, facilitating the smooth progress of track installation. RFCs are responsible for feeding and laying 200-meter long panels over the RC track bed. A total of four RFCs have been procured to date, facilitating the initial laying of temporary tracks on RC. Roles and Responsibilities of RFC Track Feeding and Laying RFC is responsible for feeding and laying 200-meter long panels over the RC track bed, ensuring the initial establishment of temporary tracks. Efficiency and Productivity With a total of four RFCs procured, NHSRCL ensures efficient and rapid progress of track laying operations. Installation of Rail Panels The RFC facilitates the installation of rail panels over the reinforced concrete, RC, track bed. It ensures the smooth and efficient laying of rail segments during the initial setup of the track. Functionality Feeding and Laying The RFC is responsible for feeding and laying 200-meter long rail panels onto the RC track bed. Pushing the rail pair as the RFC moves along the viaduct, it pushes the rail pair, two parallel rails, into position on the RC bed. Temporary track. Initially, a temporary track is laid using the RFC, providing a stable base for subsequent construction activities. Advantages. Efficiency. By handling multiple rail panels at once, the RFC streamlines the process and reduces manual labor. Structural integrity. It ensures proper alignment and structural integrity of the rail segments. Cement Asphalt Mortar Injection Car, CAM Car CAM Car plays a critical role in the final stages of track installation, ensuring the required line and level of the track. After placing track slabs on the RC bed, CAM cars run on parallel tracks, mixing ingredients for CAM mix in design proportion. This CAM mix is injected under the slab to achieve the required track line and level. NHSRCL has procured two CAM cars for this purpose. Functions of CAM car Track slabs The precast concrete track slabs are placed on the reinforced concrete, RC, track bed. CAM mix preparation CAM car prepares the CAM mix, prepares a mixture of both cement and asphalt with appropriate properties, a crucial component for achieving the required track line and level, in design proportion. Injection process, CAM mix is injected under the precast track slabs to achieve the required line and level, ensuring optimal track stability and alignment. Injection of CAM mix. The CAM car is responsible for injecting a specific material called cement asphalt mortar, CAM, beneath the track slabs. It ensures the stability, alignment, and proper functioning of the track system. Elastic modulus and vibration absorption, the CAM mix provides the necessary elastic modulus and vibration absorption characteristics for the track system. Advantages Stability, by filling the space between the track slabs and the RC anchor, the CAM car enhances stability. Optimal alignment, it ensures that the track slabs are aligned correctly. Smooth operation, the meticulous injection process guarantees the smooth operation of India's first-ever bullet train corridor. Project progress. The track laying work in Gujarat is progressing rapidly, with more than 35,000 metric tons of rails and three sets of track construction machinery already received at key locations like Surat and Vadodara. Make in India Initiative. Under the Make in India MII, policy, NHSRCL is manufacturing some of the cutting-edge machinery in India. This initiative not only supports indigenous manufacturing but also ensures that the project adheres to global standards. Future Prospects The Mumbai Ahmedabad Bullet Train Corridor is expected to cover a distance of 508 km, connecting Mumbai and Ahmedabad with a maximum speed of 320 km per hour. The corridor encompasses 12 stations along its route. The project aims to reduce travel time between the two cities to just around two hours. The entire journey is expected to take approximately two hours and seven minutes with limited stops, at Surat, Vadodara, and Ahmedabad. An all-stop service will take around two hours and 58 minutes. 
Operational Plans Once operational, the railways plans to run 35 bullet trains in each direction with approximately 70 trips per day. In the first year of operations, there will be 10 trains. The number of trains will gradually increase to 16 by the 10th year and 44 by the 20th year, aiming to increase the number to 105 trains by 2050. During peak hours, the frequency of trains is expected to be 20 minutes, and during non-peak hours, it will be 30 minutes. Each train will have a capacity of 1250 passengers. It is estimated that around 1.6 crore people will travel by the bullet train annually. The Operations Control Center for the MAHSR Corridor will be located at Sabarmati. Project Funding The total estimated cost of the project is approximately 1.08 Indian rupees lakh crore. While the center has committed 10,000 Indian rupees crore, Gujarat and Maharashtra will contribute 5,000 Indian rupees crore each. The remaining funding will be secured through a loan from Japan at a minimal 0.1% interest rate. Conclusion NHSRCL's adoption of advanced track installation methods represents a significant milestone in the development of the Bullet Train Corridor project. By embracing innovation and technology, the corporation is laying the foundation for a modern, efficient, and reliable high-speed rail network that will transform the future of transportation in India. Stay tuned for further developments on these projects. Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.